fanatics on the banks of Volca, cannibals in the mountain bunker, slavers on the shores of the dried out sea. How many monsters has the war given rise to? Or perhaps were they always there? And the war simply gave them a chance to show themselves and now we're stuck with them forever. Regardless, we can't afford to lose hope. We are getting ever closer to our dream. Finding a place where we could live, free from radiation and mutants. The maps we recovered in the desert have provided us with several promising options. And now the crew members are excitedly waiting for the Colonel's decision on where the Aurora should go next. Currently, though, the train is calmly rolling eastward. The crew rests, and Stepan proposed to Katya. It was a proposal she couldn't refuse. I'm not sure if we had that already. And... I think we're reading. Yeah. Let's... There's probably a lot of stuff here. I'm not sure which of these I've... Red, probably all of this. Yamantau. Yeah, that's done and done. Summer. Fanatics on the banks of. Ah, this is just the thing that the. Dude. Our tomb reads at the beginning. Crew? Colonel Miller, Damir. I don't know if we need. Go over these people. New world. Cannibals. Yamantau complex. Yeah. Seems suffer from heavy cerebral damage caused by an infectious disease they contracted through their diet. So their words are barely legible. Huh. Still, they're exceptionally determined in pursuing their prey and complete disregard of their own safety makes them a dangerous enemy indeed. Swarag oil. The criminal empire ruling the portion of the Caspian desert we visited was controlled by a supreme ruler called the Bacon. Bacon, because that's what he looked like. Bacon. <laughs> Using the largest oil rig in the area as his seat of power. Apparently the Baron's climb to power started within Swarag oil, an oil drilling company that had been controlling all of the oil extraction in the area when the war broke out. Svarognift. 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 Yeah. Who knows? Creatures. Is there any new creatures? Shrimp creamer, firmer. Spiderbuck. Lurker. Oh, very familiar people. People. Equipment? Nothing interesting. <clears throat> Weapon. A shot. Huh, oh, nothing. Well, I guess we're not reading anymore. What's on the radio? Ow. Eighty. Something. It's like phone ringing. Not much more than that, though. Boxery. Over. Well, doing all right, considering the radiation. 
location and all. Over. Well, be nice. I see that you're in no mood for chatter today, even though I have news. The locals did end their scuffle after all. Well, I'll tell you more when I'm back. Over. Not in the mood? It's just that we have news here too, so come over quickly if you don't want to miss all the fun. <laughs> I see. I'm gonna run then. Over and out. Good luck with your marathon. Over and out. That must be a trap to someone, or both of them. I thought it was Anna who shot her, her, him. I thought Gil was one of Monai Baler. <laughs> I really like that there's a thing. It's just Muzak. The first one wasn't playing anything. That was just the phone. Same. Same. Okay, I guess we're done. Uh, what's this? Oh, leave the light on. And get the hell out. Should I talk to her? No. Should I leave? Yeah. Oof. Everything is perfect, Adrian. Sure. Oh, 
I'll be there in just a sec. New modifications to Tihar. I don't think I have any. Or is this a new one? Can't say for sure. Huh. How the... Oh, yeah. So I got this now. I'm gonna change it to my trusty old... Shambler. If I can find it. There we go. Replace. Still with the suppressor. Uh, didn't I have... Reflex sight for this guy before. This is closed. I thought I had an open one for this. Again, I didn't install any of those. This is mud as it should be. Yeah, because this has only... Iron sights. And the red laser. Closed reflex. Sure I had an open one. Huh. Strange. Nothing here. I could make a few of these. Oh. Let's not make any more of those. Let's make a few of those though. I can probably... Thirty and fifteen. Oh, forty. I'm not doing those, so I'm going to be needed for these guys. I was supposed to follow those guys. Well, let's see what they're doing. Can't get my weapons out here, so I can. And check anything out. Not much. You should have seen them dance. Don't you worry, you'll get another chance. The moment of your attention, please. Yeah. Half a year on the road. And 4,000 clicks behind us. We have been through a lot. Yes, we have. There's more to come. I bet. Alright, people. I do understand I can't keep it a secret much longer. After a careful study of the satellite maps we've obtained, <coughs> and much deliberation, we've found a place we could call our new home. Ooh. <coughs> it is a river valley. There's forest and a hydroelectric power plant. Yeah. This place is quite far from densely populated areas, which, as our journey has proven, is important. We're about two days away from it now. So, congratulations, yeah. everyone. Yeah. 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 yeah! Yet, this is not our last <coughs> order of business for today. Stepan, Katya. Oh, rings. Stepan, Katya, 
Repeat after me. I take you to be my spouse. I take you to be my spouse. And vow to hold you from this day forward. And vow to for hold you from this day forward. For better or for worse. For richer, <laughs> for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish to love and until to cherish death do us part. As the captain of this ship, I hereby pronounce you husband and wife. Live long and be happy. Oh, and go Gorka! 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 Don't bleed on the table. Would you mind? People are trying to eat. Anna, what's happening? Be careful, people! Anna, please hold on to What's happening? What is it, Anna? What's that cough? Gotcha. Do something. Please! Don't have her! Give her air! Damn! Bling. Didn't say anything. No one probably heard what anything. Are you talking about, baby? In the Yamantau, when they dragged me away, that ghoul doctor said my lungs were falling apart. The gas I breathed in that ammo dump said How I don't have lungs. How can you believe that monster? We've just been through a desert and all that sand, so that might be the reason. Sure. Got you. Arthur, a few words. How many? Seven? Is that enough? I'm all right, Artyom. Good. Go. I'm fine now. Yay. She's probably gonna... I don't know about this. The old man is furious. Die in the end. Oh. Artyom's getting chewed out today. It's not Artyom's fault. I fell into that stupid bunker all by myself. And if Dad says one word to him about it, I'll tear him a new one. Yeah. Yes, this is getting old. As soon as something happens, it's always Artyom's fault, even when he had nothing to do with it. Hey, that That's sounds familiar. Fate? fate? Get out of here! Yes, in any case, Katya will calm the Colonel down. You shouldn't worry either, Anna. She'll fix you in no time at all. She's good. No doubt about that. We drew the lucky ticket with her, especially you, Stepan. That's a fact. Thank you, Anna. Artyom, you shouldn't keep your commander waiting. Yeah, I know. Well, on. we'll wait here. Okay. Go, Artyom. The colonel's waiting. Can't even jump. Looks different. There's no one shoveling the coal. Oh, because we're using... We're using the diesel, I thought, but I guess we're not. Think constructively. So, Katya, what do you think? I think that trusting some degenerate's diagnosis wouldn't be wise. A move from humid metro into the desert with its dry heat and sandstorms is a stress for long. Yes. Yeah, same for all of us. Really bad right off the start, had it my been thoughts gas. exactly. Thus, first I'll check her condition to the best of my knowledge. Also, we're approaching the valley with its forest air. That alone could heal her. I'm sorry to intervene, but did something happen? Oh, Anna coughed up some blood. Oh my god. Do you really think it's the same? 
Sounds more like TB to me. That's for sure. TB we can handle. We've got enough antibiotics, and air does help with that. And what if... What if that degenerate was right, Katya? What do we do? Is there a medicine? There was an air defense battery station in our village. Right on the brink of war, they received a new drug. It saved a lot of people after gas exposure and general poisoning. I'll check my mom's records and find its name. I think it was produced in Novosibirsk. Oh, God. I guess that's our next stop then. Right, Novosibirsk. You're back. Your opinion. For Anna's sake, I'd go to the edges of the earth. Ooh. As for Novosibirsk, it's about 2,000 leagues. Not that far. We head for the valley. If it is suitable, we settle there. If our state worsens, I'll take a group of volunteers to find that drug. So Katya, please, find that name for I'll us. I'll find it, don't worry. One more thing, Artyom. Huh? I want no surprises in that valley. You are our most seasoned scout. So take the rail car, one volunteer. Go check everything out before we arrive. Let's go back for now. Oh, for the love of God, check everything out. Ooh, this ladder. I haven't been here before. Oh, boy. I don't stink so. That's not. Ooh, I can smoke. I ain't gonna do it. Go down the other way. Oh crap, they're talking. I'm missing it all. That sounds like a great plan. Did I miss anything? I'd also like to say this. Guys, please don't worry. I've been feeling pretty bad as it is for ruining the party. Oh, come on. You didn't ruin anything. I just brought myself down to rock bottom over that bastard from Yamantau. Though it must just be the sand and desert climate. Of course that must be it. We were discussing exactly that just now. What? Alright, a toast. To you guys. Just be happy together. Can't. To you! To Great you. toast! What? What's the... Will you play that song? About us. Easy as pie. Easy cake. Is this Wall? She looks weird. Я видел генералов, они бьют и едят нашу смерть. Их дети сходят с ума от того, что им нечего больше хотеть. А земля лежит в ужавчине, церкви смешали с собой. И если мы хотим, чтобы было куда вернуться, время вернуться домой. Мой. Этот поезд в огне. Этот поезд в огне, и нам не на что 
Surprises like the ones we had on the Volga or in Yamantau. So we're sending a scouting party ahead on a rail car. Artyom needs a volunteer to support him. Huh? Me? Pick me! I'll check the hell out of that valley, please! <laughs> Something makes me think that Alyosha is mainly going to check if there are any Amazons or women in general there. <laughs> oh. So we're all set. How about the American? Frankly, I envy you, Stefan. You got a full family, a wife and child at once. And you don't have to worry about diapers or belly aches. Envy is a bad thing. <laughs> You're not the ones to avoid diapers, Colonel. In fact, we're planning to present Nastya with a little brother, if she doesn't object. I'd rather get a sister. We could play with dolls together. I could care for her. You could play Sparta in special operations with your brother. Ah, cut it out, Stefan. God knows we've had enough of operations. I don't know about you, but I'm tired. I'd like to retire. Time to have some life. You can't retire yet. You're too young. <laughs> I am old, Nastya. You're not. You said envy is a bad thing, Nadia. Huh? But what am I to do? Your mom has you, but my Anna doesn't have a smart curl like you. Hey. Don't dad me. A 20 year old won't even think about children. But I would sure like to see grandchildren at my age. Yeah, you teach them CQC. Dual wielding pistols. <laughs> 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 of course, you're welcome, Nastya. The thing is, Grandpa Miller won't give up until he has grandchildren of his own. Hear that, Artem? I don't even know what else to say. She's beautiful, sporting. Yeah, I'm Olympic level with a rifle. I get not having kids in metal. Darkness, TV, rats, mutations. But what about here? We'll get to work on solving your problem tonight. And that note, how about a drink? To repopulation of Earth. To kids. Yes! To children! <laughs> to children! Guess I was too fast. Better timing. This is great. And having more so really joining. <laughs> Alyosha, I never doubted you. Yes, Alyosha. I don't think you should be worried about that. If we are successful, there will be people joining us. Honest, good people. I'm sure they survive too. Well, if any bad people decide to show up, they'll be sorry they did. <laughs> When we're done with the bad apples here, we might think of something to do about Moscow. That's true. To love! To love! No, it's late. Ooh. 
It's your turn, Artyom. Come on, impress us. How? What do you mean? I turn to what? What? Why? Thought I was going to... What? Am I gonna slap her? Ah, no. Really, do I have to play something? Oh, of course. At least it turned out goddamn radio. I haven't learned it any further than that, so that'll be it for now. Stepan, play some more. I'ma take off. Stepan, could you give us that one? By Boris. My pleasure. Song by Borat. Dabri, dabra, dabra. Pasha, pasha, pasha. Anything new? Hello, my friend. As you can see, we're busy with giving the weapons some proper care after the desert. Yeah. Yeah, I hate sand, I must say. It's rough and coarse and gets everywhere. Irritates me to no end. Shame. So, as soon as we got out of that hellhole, I started cleaning and overhaul. Good. And Duke, being the kind of guy that he is, volunteered to help. Why are you so close? Yeah, That's kind of. You're a slave driver, like that Baron. <laughs> well, you should have taken the Shambler for a dive in the sand. It's not a kalash. I didn't even shoot it afterwards. Thank God. I don't know if it even will shoot though. So you, young man, got lucky there. Yes, it is a mystery, really, how those bandits managed to keep their guns working in that desert. Mm. Though their gunsmiths are good. That gun you brought back is definitely custom made. A fine job. And it's been well maintained, too. This just warms my heart. That thing? I wouldn't have a poor showing here either, given a chance. Oh, the Shambler. The Tihar with the new ammo would have worked wonders there. I'm sure you'll give it a try later, though. Yeah, I forgot well, about yes. that. You could have barbecued them all. If I remembered, I had those. Yes, in any case, you don't need to worry about the weapons, Artyom. I'll have them in mint condition by the time God we make it, our next dead. stop. <laughs> all right, another rub. Yeah, give it a good rub. Um, so, no new no anything. Damn it, Usually so I've had some new right, match for this guy. Rub. This might be new, I'm Just not sure. A bit more. What the hell? I, it I still should doesn't just go away. try it. This is uh, why perfect. not? What the hell? 
I'm supposed to take the uh, rail car. How do I do that? I wonder. Wow, 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 wow. Oh. I guess I found out. Oh, we took the goddamn shit and build with us. Ooh, a book. Talk out of note. Crest, I'm writing you a note because I really wouldn't want anyone to overhear. You see, I'm preparing a wedding surprise for Katya and Stepan, and I need your help. I'm making rings for them, and I already have them. I have the band to make them out of. I just need their sizes. How the hell? Stepan's not a problem after all. I make gloves for all the crew, but I never measured Katya's fingers, and it would be a dead giveaway if I wanted to do it now. I know you have a sharp eye, so perhaps you could help me get the size right without measuring. I could also use some help with buffing the rings once they're soldered, as there's not much time left. Thanks in advance. And I missed two. Only two things in the Caspian. Hmm, huh. intriguing. And it's summertime. Ooh. Okay. Well, Bratucha, Anna sure gave us all this care. Yep. Oh, but don't you worry. It does look like tuberculosis, but Katya is a real medic. She, no, she'll put her back on the feet in no time at all. Oh, besides, there's finally something nice ahead: a river, a forest, even a hydroelectric dam. Yeah. <laughs> that sounds interesting. <laughs> I haven't fixed one yet. So don't worry, Artyomich, everything will be fine. Soon we'll have a chance at normal lives at that vet, you know? Sure. Are you and Anna gonna have kids? Artyom, it's about time, Bratucha. Moscow doesn't sound right for those with radiation. What's and beeping? Like valley. Oh, that's the oh. place. And Stupan and Katya would follow suit, too, since they're married. <laughs> uh, who knows? We do have to populate the colony, you know. We'll build a good one, too, with some skilled people, and most importantly, smart people. Where can we find those? And we'll surely attract more. And if some assholes decide to crash the party, ho, 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 we'll send them packing in no time with our guys. Yeah. Of course, that valley needs checking out first. The colonel is absolutely right. But you and Alyosha, you can handle that, no problem. Yeah, but how? Where do I go there from? That cursed mountain? Oh. I had this nasty feeling back then. I even told the colonel why. He was so eager to see that minister of his, he didn't care. Ah, that. Not quite like him, huh? Uh-huh. But well, that's to be expected, you know? Everyone has a string which, when pulled, makes you forget about everything else. Yeah, I have many of those. This he got shot like a dog and serves him right. Remember how we rushed to fly the Baron? That one was a real bastard, of course. Treating people like that over nothing, yeah, just as bad as the Astrakhan gang. Tasty got shot like a dog and serves him right. Yeah. Would be nice to wipe out all of his lieutenants. Uh, you know what? I'm sure Gyul will handle them just fine. Sure. Uh, she's not a girl who'd leave a job half done, huh? Unlike me. <laughs> So what I'm saying is, we weren't roasting in that oven for nothing, huh? We also helped people, besides getting those maps. Uh, some. Ah, uh, well, <coughs> I think I'll finish with your trophy here. Go prepare the rail car for a recon trip with Alyosha. Speaking of him, I think he wanted to go with you so badly because he also had a feeling, you know, in his usual direction. <laughs> Look at the Tletchet before he finds his, uh, you know, head stuck somewhere nasty, will you? Sure. If you'll do the so, same. I have me. to give it to you, Bratucha. Bringing this beauty here was a stroke of genius. I feel she's going to help us a lot. This? 
Mind you, I'm not trading my rail card for anything in the world, but this baby here is just amazing. I hate it. Never mind the looks. Her engine has been finely tuned and maintained. She's got a strengthened frame and springs. Even her brakes are in perfect order. Uh. The mechanic skill and passion are as plain as day here, and I love that. I mean, really, this thing reminds me of my old bay. The one I once drove out of Kadui. Oh, but it looks like the windshield is removed. The half truck from that work had been rusting in a scrapyard for 40 years at least. Ran on firewood like the Aurora. Of course it was more memory than a truck. The cabin was all rotten. Plywood don't keep that well. Platform was missing altogether. But the engine with the gearbox and the gas generator was still there. The frame was okay. Yeah. Yeah, that was a piece of work. A month without taking a break but in the end it ran then i put the body of the same minibus you have here on the top of the frame and driving that franken bus i went as far as astrakhan mind you that thing didn't have more than 30 hp on its birthday terrible hassle too but you not just have to chop firewood you have to make the sticks even and nice or else it doesn't run well mm -hmm. takes a lot of experience like heating up a proper sauna you know? yep so i'd spend half a day getting ready a couple of hours driving yeah fell in love with that thing oh mamachka no wonder after all that effort still had to give it to one bastard in astrakhan otherwise i would have just been killed right there and that's if i got lucky huh so that's that how it went back then flock of birds as for this beauty, I'll take good care of her. For all time's sake, she'll be winning every car show we run across, huh? This shit. Ain't she beauty? Oh, two crossovers, oh. Maya, like a bride on her wedding day. Perfect. What? So, there you have it, Bratucha. There you have it. So, you have any idea how to get on that goddamn rail car? Well, thanks. I guess you don't. And it's stuttering again. Not the game, but the... Uh, NDI thingy. The white dust. What? Ah. So, how the hell do I continue? Can I take a shit? No. You boys keep rubbing. Oh, I have to look at the goddamn map. Then I can continue. Coming through. Can't play the piano. Your Mac. Ooh, I can sound the horn. Honk. Nothing here, I suppose. No. And nothing here. There's nothing there. Probably not. Oh, dude. No talk. Artyom, Something. I wanted to tell you for some time, but hadn't had a chance. Yeah. Anna asked if I wanted to stay back then. I'm sure I did. They were my people, even though I couldn't find any relatives. Besides, there are still lots of bandits to kill there. But the Baron is dead. Now you can lead the people. They know those animals can be beaten. Cannon must be beaten. And now they have to fight for their freedom and take it by their own hand. So that not to give it up ever again, despite any odds. Still, uh -huh. the initial push was given by us. By you. By me? I won't forget this, Artyom. 
and I hope to one day pay this debt back. Okay. Kepragmet. Kepragmet. Pratucha. Yeah. I'm gonna go look at the map. What will we find out? Uh, you can resume the journey or continue exploring the train. I shall resume the journey. I can't say I've ever been religious. But right now I'm begging all gods. Please, watch over Anna. And make the valley cure her of her affliction. In the meantime, Alyosha and I are on a recon mission. We have no idea of what is waiting for us there. Though Alyosha seems convinced that there are going to be crowds of women eagerly anticipating his arrival. If that turns out to be the case, then I have the best companion possible for this mission. Yeah, that's probably going to happen. I am not doubting for a second. Yes, I must say, I'm rather partial to this valley. Take it Whoa, that was a big hit. Never smelled air like this in my life. I bet if we spend a week there, it won't just cure Anna. It'll make Colonel grow his feet back. Dave, this is one bumpy ride. The rails are all bent. The whole track seems to be fixing to slide down. I sure hope it can hold our weight. Let's hail the Aurora and tell them to take the other road. Come in, Aurora. This is forward recon. Do you read? Over. Situation is completely awesome, Colonel. Sir, Anna is sure to love it here. Over. So the plan goes like this we get to that dam, check it out quickly, and call them over. Just take a look at all this beauty, huh? Don't you want them to see it sooner? Man. What in the I guess that's it for the way To what? Oh, I guess that was the rock. Heart is still beating. That's a good sign. Don't go to the light. Or do go to the light. Either way, you can't move. It's wide. Give it that. Who the hell? Forest child. Nothing here. Our guys caught your friend, but I can see your two are not bandits. I'll help you out if you don't do anything stupid. Gotta run now. Just stay out of sight and you'll be fine. Catch you later. Okay.
So, what now? It's awfully dark. Okay. So is this like the Mars level? Or something. Did she steal my stuff? I think she stole my stuff. I don't even have my backpack. Well, there is a problem to solve. 